Tonight, a North County city is just days away from essentially shutting down after several employees say they won't show up for work. This is taking place in Bell Fountain neighbors. Workers there say that they won't show up until a new budget is passed. The Board of Aldermen is set to have an emergency meeting Monday, but the budget is not on the agenda. All new here at 10, our Dion Broxton is hearing from one angry employee demanding answers. Jeff Sullivan is up early every morning, maintaining streets in Belfont and neighbors. But Monday, his machines will be silent. And we're walking out Monday. Starting Friday night, residents will see this sign explaining that nearly every city worker is going on strike due to the city's inability to pass a budget. Staff with the city say the police department isn't taking part in the strike, but they do have the support from the department. These employees don't get have not had a raise in two years because of them not passing a budget. The city has been using the same budget for three years in a row. Sullivan says the city continues to lose workers. It's two laborers and me trying to take care of 52 miles of roads because nobody wants to come work here. Yes, there are positions that are open. Um, if we could have some cooperation with the mayor, those positions probably would be uh, fulfilled. Three aldermen, which includes the board president, told First to Look for Monday Mayor Dinah Tatman wants her hand-picked candidates to fill open positions. They add she wants to overpay them. We have to make sure that we, have, we can sustain our payroll. Tatman says it's taking too long to find qualified candidates and the city needs to move faster on hiring. The city currently doesn't have a full-time qualified person to handle the city's finances. Sullivan says he has enough paid time off to be gone for a month. He hopes it doesn't come to that. This can all stop. All you need to do is pass the budget, and then you guys can go back to fighting again. A special meeting is scheduled for Monday night, but the budget is not on the agenda. Dion Braxton, first alert for